Hello, my beautiful BBW babes. I'm back. Well, I haven't been um, recording lately because I've been a little under the weather, but I've been feeling a little better for the past two days. So I decided to make this video for you guys. And this video is um, obviously going to help me too as well because like I told you, I haven't been feeling well. So today I'm going to make a natural facial exfolio exfoliation. Huh. exfoliating concoction <laughs> um i like doing it because it refreshes my face it also you know takes off any dead skin we have and it really helps illuminate your face or at least mine it does hopefully it all does the same for you it's a very natural and it only um contains three products basically or three items whatever you want to call it, okay? Believe it or not, it has coffee grind, you know, from your coffee in the morning. That's what we're gonna use. We're also gonna use cornstarch, or as they say in Spanish, maicena. And honey, okay? So this is what we do. We're gonna, I'm gonna mix it first. And that way you see how much of everything we're going to put in our little bowl here. All right? So we're going to start off with a spoonful of the coffee grind. Okay? That's why I told you it's natural. Okay? So, like about this amount is okay. Once you want to put in a little bit more, you can. Okay? So we'll put in this little bit like this. All right? Leave that spoon there, and then we'll take another clean spoon, and we're gonna also do a spoon, one spoon, one tablespoon. Usually these are like tablespoons, just so you guys know. A tablespoon of each, and one tablespoon of the cornstarch. Okay. Oh, getting dirty. Oh well. Also, make sure you wear something that you don't mind getting dirty. Okay. So, um, <clears throat> we're gonna take a spoonful. About like this, about the same amount we do with the coffee. Okay, just one. Just one of each. One of the coffee, one of the cornstarch, and a few drizzles of the honey. Okay. Hello. Okay, here we go. A few drizzles of the honey. Let me put it out so you guys can see the mix, okay? A few drizzles. That's good. Okay. And now we go ahead and mix it. If you want to add more honey or more of any of the other items, you may go right ahead and do so. It has to have some type of texture and I'll show you in a bit. I'm probably gonna have to add more honey just because I did add a little bit more than a, than a spoonful of the coffee. So yeah, let me go ahead and add a little bit more of the, um, cause you want it to have, um, not a really watery texture, but you know, we want it so we can be able to, um, smear it easier on our faces. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to show you. Okay. So you just keep adding as much honey as you can so you could get that texture that I'm going to show you. See, it's already getting that little, because we need it to be loose in order to put it on our faces. And I need it, so this is a refresher, okay? Hopefully it'll help you guys too. You can usually, um, you have a hard week, tired week, um, and you want to refresh your face. This is a really good, um, exfoliant or whatever you want to call it for the face um it's also like a mask because you're gonna see so it's a little bit of everything <laughs> okay so this is the texture let me see if you guys can see it this is the texture the consistency that we want okay like this so that's why i had to add a little bit more of the honey because since i did add a little more of the um coffee grind you may still was a little rough, so. But this is what we're looking for, okay? So this is perfect, all right? So before we put that on, of course, we need to wash our faces. So um, I'm going to put on my cute little 
little hair piece here. Pull my little bun, my little thing here. Out of it. Okay. And we are going to start off with first. Oh, we got cornstarch all over. All right. We're going to start off with first washing our faces, like I told you guys. Okay. And like you guys know, this is the facial cleanse that I like. All right. So let's go ahead and wash our faces. Be right back. I always try to wash it with a little bit of warm water. Okay. Ah, do a little pump. My little washer here. I wet my face. And now I'll go ahead and wash as much as I can. You know, around the eyes, the pores, down here. If you want to put some on. Any area, obviously, in your face that you're going to go ahead and put this on. You want it to be clean. Because you want it. We don't want any of the oil of our faces or if you have any makeup or anything on to be in the way. Okay, so I'll go ahead and take this off now. Mm, my hair's in the way. Mm. I feel like I'll just wash my hair. All right. So here I am, patting down my face dry. I don't want to, you know, um, rub it because I don't want to burn, feel any kind of burning or anything. When I put the, I mean, I don't think you should, because I don't think any of that would be burning. Oh, let's see what my hair's got wet. But, you know, since we are going to be scrubbing the, um, the, well, not scrubbing, we're going to be rubbing in the, um, the coffee grind in our faces. We don't want to hurt our faces, okay? All right, so, it's already nice and clean. Okay, so now let me take off my ring. Um, you don't have to do that, but if you don't want to get anything in your ring, then you know, go ahead and do that. I don't want I just did it because I don't want any of the stuff getting in my ring and my boyfriend be like, um, what happened to your ring, girl? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right, so we are going to use a very special tool to put this on our faces. Our fingers. <laughs> All right, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to put it all around our faces like a regular mask, okay? Or any, or, um, of course, yeah, any mask that you put on or any kind of scrub or anything. We're going to put it on and we'll mix it again. Just make sure it's all in there. It could get a little messy, just so you guys know. So, um, you know, if you don't mind, then... Let's get our fingers dirty. Okay. Let me put this spoon here. So it doesn't matter in my way. So just put on a little bit at a time. Okay. Um, I'm going to be looking at the mirror here. Just so you guys, okay. If you guys see me looking somewhere else, I'm not going cuckoo. I'm just looking at the mirror that's right in front of me. So yeah, just start putting it on. Okay. Don't rub it in too much right now. Just because you want to put it all in our faces. Once it's all in our faces... We will be leaving it on for 20 minutes, okay? That's why I said it's like a mask, because we will be leaving it on for 20 minutes, okay? So just put it on, and, and it doesn't have to cover all your face, okay? Yeah, I don't want, you know, if you don't see your whole entire face all black with the, or brownish with the, with the mixture, doesn't mean that you don't have it in there. It's in there, it's just, of course, you know, it's not gonna, not gonna be like a regular, normal mask that you buy in the store because it's naturally made at home and it's just it's with coffee grind okay so let me put some on my forehead like this okay and then we're going to put some down there yeah oh. like i said everywhere that you want to refresh your face you're going to put it all on there okay 
So, here we go. Our nose area, right here around our lip area too. Okay, all right. So here we go, we have it on our faces. All right, so once it's on like this, okay, we're not gonna put it in our side of our eyes or anything like that. Once you have it on like this, like I said, we will be leaving it on for 20 minutes, okay? So go relax with it or do what you gotta do. Um, I, I, It'd be better if you relax with this, you don't make any movements, just chill, let it sick in. And then, let me take some of this off my hand. Then, when you're ready, after the 20 minutes, to take it off. Because I don't want you guys to sit there and sweat or anything like that. So, you know, I prefer for you guys to just chill. Take a wine, a glass of wine or juice or even the same coffee. <laughs> and just chill and relax for 20 minutes, okay? And then we will be taking it off our faces, okay? So go relax and we'll be back in 20 minutes. Hello, I'm back. All right, so um, I've had the um, mask on for 20 minutes and it's dry. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it is dry and um, you can feel it in your face, that's dry. So now we are going to wash it off. Um, let me first say, for anybody that's um, signing on now, um, this is a mask that I usually like to do at least once a week or whenever I really need it, when I feel like I'm really tired or you know I need to refresh my face. I like to do this because it does um, help take any dead skin off. It helps exfoliate your face um, and illuminates you. <laughs> But you know, you do feel a little difference. I'm not, you know, I, I, at least me, I, I do. Hopefully, if you guys try it, it'll also help you guys. And then, of course, like I always say, please let me know if it works for you, whatever I put up. Um, this is with three items, like I said in the beginning of the video. It's going to be with your coffee grind, one spoon of that, one spoonful of that, one spoonful of my Santa, which is cornstarch, and a few drizzles of honey until you get this consistency okay it has to be you know um a little wet there see and then you put it on your face you first wash your face and then you put it on and you leave it on for 20 minutes until it's nice and dry like it's now so i'm going to show you guys what we do this is the exfoliating part that i was telling you guys about let me turn you guys over so you guys can see what I'm about to do. Okay, so hopefully like that you can see a little more, okay. So, we're gonna wet our faces like this. Wet it, okay? And before we take everything off completely, we are going to rub in the coffee drying like this. You can, this is what helps to take off whatever dead skin or any, any, anything that's in our faces that we don't need, but it does help exfoliate our skin, okay? So we wet it and do it slowly and softly. You don't have to be melting hard, okay? That way we don't scratch our faces or, okay? If you do have sensitive skin, you could try it. Um, I'm not gonna tell you no, but if you guys are, so sensitive that you guys can't do anything harsh on your face and definitely do not try it um but if you guys want to it's up to you you go ahead and do so okay so once you rub everything in in your faces and you feel like you rubbed it in enough okay mm -hmm. then definitely we take everything off now Okay, so just wash it off your face.
So, once you have all the coffee grind off your face, do not wash the face with any type of cleanser, okay? It's just warm water, and that's it, to take everything off. Because once you, um, when you're washing your face, you're going to feel that your face is nice and soft underneath with everything. Remember, we use honey, so that helps our faces to feel nice and smooth. So you don't need to um, put any type of um, cleanser in your face when you're washing it, okay? All right, so once it's off, of course, you're gonna dry your face, okay? Um, pat it down, okay? And I can actually feel the difference on my face. I can actually, I can even um, see it. When, if you try it, you will see for yourself that you feel your face is even um, softer and cleaner. You're gonna see it's it's I like using it. It's it's very um it's very relaxing for your face and it helps it look more luminous, makes you feel more revived. I kid you not. I'm not gonna lie to you. It really does. Okay, so if you wanna add any other finishing touches after it, you may. Uh what I'm gonna do is I'm going to put some of the facial mist that I use. You can use whatever other um, thing you like you could use um, rose water um, the micellar water too whatever just to refresh the face okay so I'm just gonna spritz a little bit okay just so my face could feel even more refreshed and that's it I'm not even gonna add any type of cream or anything on my face I'm gonna leave it like this okay so there you go that's basically what um what this face coffee mask is all about um i hope you guys try it um and if you do like i always say please let me know if it worked for you or if it didn't work for you but i would prefer if it worked for you <laughs> but yeah just let me know how it went and if you feel the same way that i feel like your face feels more refreshed you feel like you're ready to conquer another week please let me know i would love to share with other people um your experience as well all right Thank you for watching, you guys.